everybody! Welcome back to One Month in My Bullet Journal. It's April 3rd. Um, but of course, as we've established, I'm filming this the day before. It's April 2nd and I am not done with everything I want to get done. But um, I showed you all last week how I was doing like dailies as well as a weekly um, just for like evening stuff that I wanted to get done. So I did that again today. I had to leave work early for a doctor's appointment. I had to pick up gas on the way and then um, I had to take my uh, gestational diabetes test, uh, which basically involved sitting uh, outside the, the lab for an hour. So I brought some stuff to do. Um, and then I have sort of a, a plan here for the evening, which starts right now, as you uh, see this. I'm gonna be, huh, I want to do some sewing. Um, this is a little pattern that I got from I don't remember what the website is. Oh, here it is. MeganNielsen.com for a uh, little bra nursing pad thingy. I've got to make stuff uh, because, yeah, three months to go. All right, anyway, I did a daily and it's just an evening daily and then, yeah, I didn't touch this. Like I looked at it, but I didn't touch it. Added some things for my to do's here. This to do and this to do are the same but I might still have other things to do for this if that makes sense so I'll put extra dots along here if I need to um, and then in yesterday's video you saw me set all this up and then afterwards I realized I need to add something else to the tracker um, we're doing the Divine Mercy uh, Novena which runs from this Friday before Easter to the Saturday after. Um, and so I had to move this tape up a square to make room to add an extra row here. And then um, I've actually now realized, I think I'm going to add another row on top again. And I'm not gonna try to reuse this tape a third time. I'm gonna use a new piece of tape because I'm not stingy. You probably can't see, but I kind of, the first time I removed it, it kind of ripped the paper a little bit. Um, I'm just going to choose to ignore that. Um, but I'm going to add yet another row and hope this is the last time. Um, it's time to start doing some kit counts. Um, and this handwriting is not great. <laughs> Sorry. So, uh, the little chart that they gave me at the doctor's office only starts at week 28, but they said to start now, so I figure I may as well. Um, but since there's not a place on the chart they gave me, I'm going to just fill in the number here that I would normally have filled. It's about the same size. These boxes are about the same size as what they gave me at the doctor's office. So um, I'll just do that and then possibly even keep doing that um, and then transfer it over to their chart periodically haven't decided um, but in any case for this week that's what I'm doing this is too long I want it to there we go little bits of tape I'm actually kind of surprised by how much I like the combination of these two washi tapes. It's pretty cool. A bit farther over. It's one of those artsy things that you feel like you have to be really precise for some reason. I do not have to be precise. Um, yes, I'm choosing to ignore this being slightly wonky as well because it doesn't bother me. It will only bother me if I let it bother me and there's no reason for me to let it bother me. Just don't. All right. So there are those. I'm gonna actually pull out, this is the little pen case that, I just got this from Daiso. This is what I keep in my purse. Currently I have in here a Micron I've got this red pen, which I use in some of the YouTube planning headers. 
These blues are from my April spread. If I add anything to my April spread, I can highlight or whatever. Um, and yeah, and then this red one here. Uh, I sometimes I used to cross this off uh, in my my upcoming YouTube video checklist spread thingy, which is in here somewhere. Here, I cross off the videos that I've made when they're done, so I don't have to worry about them. But um, I don't have all of these videos for this month listed in there because they're all the same every single day. Um, I took my vitamins today already. There we go. Um, and I need to actually make this bit of a uh, tracker. It is a little bit tricky to tell um, because the bit of the top layer of paper here that reaches this top corner is uh, kind of missing. Just paying attention. I'm not talking because I'm paying attention. It bothered me the tiniest little bit that this row, like you could kind of, well, when I say you, I mean I could kind of tell that it was added on after the fact. Um, and you know what? It's better to have it here and be very, very slightly wonky than to be not there at all because you want to remember to do things. And I'm sorry, I know that my weird perfectionism might be making some of you feel bad or something. Like, that's not the intention. I'm not saying that anybody has to be as a perfectionist as I am about these lines. It's much healthier if you are not that much of a stickler about it. You know, it's one thing that's nice about these microns and the ink in them. Is that they don't smudge. Uh, I make, like, sometimes ruler lines on my work bujo and in that i'm pretty much using a pilot g2 for everything and it's a fairly i showed you that journal in my uh vlog from las vegas it's fairly fine like uh smooth paper not like super high quality or anything but it's it's relatively smooth paper it's comparable to like a moleskin um so it doesn't dry right away and that's just kind of annoying because i have to be really careful not to smudge especially since i'll get like those blobs of wetter ink as you go along um yeah man now this tracker is starting to look a little bit more daunting it's like as tall as it is wide it is yes um we'll see how well i do and like i said hopefully having the video box like when i finish editing this video and i upload it uh the night before so that it's ready to go live in the morning of I'll be able to fill this out and then I'll have this open and go, okay, don't forget to stretch and wash your face and all that um, before you go to bed. So that's, that's what that reminder is for. Tomorrow or today when you're watching this, the third um, pretty normal day at work, confirmation in the evening. Um, I need to wash one of my bras and do a couple things on MH. And... Hmm trying to think if there's any of these. I think this. Hmm. I don't know. All right, I'm gonna put it on Thursday and I'll migrate it if I need to. Um, this, I will put this on Tuesday. I need to do some research on this, this thing. And then I will start on this on Wednesday. It's good to assign stuff in advance so that I don't worry about like running out of time to do it, you know? Yeah, okay. Yeah, all right, we'll figure the rest out as it happens and really just how much time I feel like I have in the evenings and stuff. But um, yeah, I'm gonna finish up here and then move on to the rest of my evening, which involves, you know, editing this video and hopefully getting some work done on a sewing project. So. That is all 
Thank you guys for watching. If you found that interesting or useful at all, be sure to subscribe because I'm gonna be making more and more of these all April, every single day. So I will see you guys in the next one tomorrow. Have a good one, bye.